Don, what the f is this, bro? Rammstein. Du hast. <laughs> is that how you say it? Rammstein. Bro, how have you never heard of this? Bro, maybe because I'm American? What has that got to do with anything? Is Are they from America? Nah, dog. Germany. <laughs> Yo, is this dude on a... What is that? What is going on here, bro? <laughs> Yo, he's on a treadmill. Hold up. What is going down, world? Welcome to the 40-year-old FUQ Boys podcast. I go by the name Black Pegasus. And it's your boy, Don Wannabe. Man, I just almost fell off the table. Uh, yeah, dude. that treadmill, uh, little known fact, that treadmill actually powers all of the lights and the sound and everything. So he's, Man, once, you're once lying, they get dude, rocking, you're he's, he's going to start running like a gerbil. Dude, this is what the okay. So okay, so I'm gonna be. Is real that how you stay it? I thought it with the two M's because I lived. I'm. I lived in Germany, and there was a, a, a no, Ramstein. Ram, uh, Brochen, Kindesnitzel. What is it? Eins, zwei, drei, vier, fünf, sechs, sieben, acht, neun, zehn. All right, I'm impressed. That's way more than I was expecting. Und Salat, bitte schön, bitte ein bit. I think they're German. Bitte ein Ramstein. To be real with you, I've never seen Ramen, this video. Ramenstein. I've only heard the song. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah, I've never heard of Rammstein. But I had no idea what they were like. Someone was like, after we did Nightwish, they're like, you got to uh, react to this. So I put it in, and I saw reactions, and I saw all these people reacting to this video. I was like, let's just do this one. It looks kind of crazy from, from the thumbnails I saw. So I was like, all right, let's do it. All right, well, let's get into it, you guys. Don't forget to like, share, and comment on all the content. But if you're really rocking with the vibe, subscribe to the channel. Um, let's get it popping, man. 40. 40 year old what, boys what? are back in town. Do hast. The boys are back in town. 40 year old what, boys what? are back in town. The boys are back in town. 40 year old FUQ Boys Podcast. Malt liquor for your ears. 40. All right, you yes, guys. Sir. Let's go ahead and get into this. Um, before I pull this logo down, don't forget, we got. Oh, actually, we got some really cool reactions on the channel. Harry Mack, Coast Contra, Ren, some NF stuff, uh, Nightwish. We've been we've been getting exposed to a lot of new stuff on YouTube. But most importantly, we do have original content, music, music videos, sketches, freestyles off the top of the brain. So tap into the channel for the original content as much as the reactions. Um, new video, Planned It, is out now. And let's get into this, man. I, I just... I don't know how you say it. I thought it'd be like Rammstein or something because it has two M's, but no, Ram, just Rammstein. 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 Stein. Rammstein. Stein. All I know is there's Stein, a, Stein. when we were in Germany, there's Rammstein Air Force Base. Um, I, I We were stationed on Spangdalem. I lived in a German town called Binsfield. And that's where I, we lived with the, with, I played on a German soccer team, all that stuff. I, it was kind of interesting. It was cool. It was actually one of the best times of my life, actually, like growing up in Germany. Um, I was born on a German Air Force base, for you guys that don't know. Landstuhl. Germany. Okay, they are German, so. At uh, least I got that part right. I mean, I had to look it up. I'm sorry. Yeah, no, I'm going to pull this. Uh, let's just see what this is about. I'll pull it up Before on my they phone, too. Rename our channel the 40 year old L Boys. We're always <laughs> just taking L's, so <laughs> getting shit wrong. <laughs> Somebody put something in the comments. We did a reaction because. I think it was Ren, and they were like, oh, 10 Downing Street. And I was like, oh, I'm pretty sure that's where, like, Parliament is. Mm -hmm. And I had just said, like, oh, you're like, how do you know that? I'm like, because I'm a man of culture. And <laughs> 10 seconds later, I'm, like, totally botching everything. That's funny. All right, let's get it, you guys. Uh, uh, this is Ra Rammstein, uh, Paris, Du Hast. Du Hast. Right, let's I'm get gonna, it. I'm going to pull up these lyrics on my phone, too. Let's see what's up. I've never inquired as to the lyrics. Because it won't take closed caption. Yo, I, why is he on a treadmill? This is insane. He's getting his steps in. He 
these theatrics are freaking insane. I'm going to be real with you. I had a friend, this was a while back, not that long ago, though, that was like, oh, I'm going to a concert. I'm like, who are you going to see? And they were like, Rammstein. And I was like, really? Of all the groups, like the Duhas, Rammstein? He's like, yeah, their show's amazing. And I'm like, okay, bro. When I was searching for this, I saw they sold out Madison Square Garden. I'm like... <laughs> Like it's rare for like because we found out about Nightwish from the YouTube, yeah. not like they're touring America like that. Yeah, but I guess these dudes are just big everywhere, huh? Because I wonder if a, they're touring right now. Dude, I'm kind of tripping out. I've <laughs> never seen anything like this in my life. This looks bro. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Like, I just don't even know where to start with this one, dude. I mean, can we talk about this lead singer in his outfit? I don't know if he just stepped out of me, Mad Max, this Fury one, I Road. I was going to say, it reminds me of... Was he, like, shoveling coal in, like, the steam room of a What does do host mean? Do you or know did he means? just come out of a German sex dungeon? I do not know. It could have go any way. Do you know what do host means? Nah, dog. I've never... Spent the time to look at the lyrics. Okay, lyric genius. It says the verse, you have, or you, you have, you have me. You, you have, you have me. Oh, do host, so do must be you. And ha host is have. Bro, we're learning German on the show. Do you, do you want until death separates you to be faithful to her for all days? Yes, no, yes, no. Do you want until death which would separate to love her even in bad days. Yes, no. And then it's du ha du you, you have, you have me. Oh, is this song about getting married? Hold on, dude. This is, yo, I am so intrigued by this. I'm losing, bro, I'm like losing. I'm like, dude, what is this? Okay. That does almost sound like some wedding vows. Bro, <laughs> imagine if I get remarried. That I'm playing this. Be like, no, we're going to play this for the wedding vows. Du hast. Du hast, song by Rammstein. The double entendre meaning of du hast by Rammstein. Song is actually about a kind of loyalty, said Krups. We see Rammstein like a kind of family. We have a strong awareness. Hold on. Du hast means you have da, 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 da. story behind the song. Du hast, loyalty. 
So it is about loyalty. It sounds like it's about getting married almost, which is kind of crazy. For people just be this. Bro, is this like the German Metallica? Would you call this? Because I'm not really familiar with Metallica, but that's what I'm guessing. Like, dude, I'm not a rock dude, man. I'm a rap guy. I'm a rapper. I, I mean, I'm stumped. I, I really don't know that much about them. Like, I knew the one song. That's why, you know, when I had a friend that was like, oh, I'm going to see Rammstein. I was like, really? The do house dudes? Like, okay. This is, I just feel like, I don't know. But what. that just shows my ignorance because I just don't know. It's like, I know one song. But you know how that is. Sometimes, like, what, you know, Radiohead, for instance, they had that song Creep, like, back in the day. That was, like, a big, well-known song. And a lot of people know them for that. That's what I knew them from. But they have a giant catalog, and they're, like, loved by people for their music. This is just crazy. Like, there's so many different elements jumping through the screen. And just how he's like, it sounded like he said, shout it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's like, dude, now I'm going to give him some props, okay? In this age of body positivity, he looks like he'd be putting up the weights. He looks kind of yoked. And then the dude's just on the treadmill. I'm like, I'm with that. I'm with all the exercising. This this whole I was video. I making sure the chant wasn't like, <laughs> like something crazy. But it's like, yo, this is ill. This whole video is actually an ad for taking care of yourself. This guy's like, do 10,000 10, steps a day, bare minimum. He grabbed his D, though, like pretty. He yeah. did the Michael Jackson joint. Bro, he he's not playing. That's that, you know, masculine like, energy. Host. He's not afraid of Host. it. Ooh. Bro, he's got a holster for his mic. That's, dude, that's legendary. I know. That's what I want now. Dude, he's not trying to buy the style, but have like a holster a sword. for your mic. And you're just like, yo, imagine just having it like this. And it was like, and you pull it out and you're like, yo, what's good, y'all? <laughs> yeah, just have like a battle axe with the mic like right there. And you just have a battle axe on stage. Like, do, do host. Ah. Dang, bro. Just giving people in the front row haircuts. Like, whoosh, I'm tripping. Just fades. High top fades. Look at this crowd. Jeez. In Paris. This ain't even in Germany. Okay, that's why your boy went to the show. Oh, yeah. As soon as I, the first couple seconds, I was like, I'm an idiot. Like, of, of course he went to the show. This is insane. I and again, like, I know of the song, but I, I've never seen any videos, never no. seen any imagery. I had no idea what anyone looks like. Dude. Now it makes me wonder, like, about the rest of their catalog. Like, what other type of. Rammstein is <clears throat> lit. Literally. Pun intended. Like the stage is on fire, bro. Yeah. The I thought he had a flamethrower. This dude <laughs> shot rockets, bro, at the crowd. B, bro. Oh shit! I was not expecting that either. I was like, oh, this guy's got a t-shirt gun on stage. Yeah, like, <laughs> I was like, he's got a confetti gun. <laughs> yeah. This fool said. <laughs> I was he's like, like Yo. hey guys, time for the glitter bomb. Boom. Bro, let me bring that back. That was the craziest sh I've ever seen, bro, on stage. I ain't never seen no. Sh is this it right here? What is going on, bro? Yeah, you gotta go. Yeah. Oh my god, there dude. we go. This is crazy, bro. Look at him. Look at this dude. He's a G. What the front door is going on, y'all? This dude said, "Do hast, mm -hmm. do hast, bro." <laughs> Ooh. 
Bro, what in the absolute this dude so many Okay, so I've been to, you know, a ton of EDM shows. I've been to Burning Man, so I've seen some amazing, like, laser lights and even some pyrotechnics, but I've never seen, like, pyrotechnics like that. So, you know, being there in the presence and seeing that happen, the other thing is, is, like, the heat that is coming off of those. So if you're in the crowd, you're getting, like, this full sensory experience where you have, like, the music, the visuals, and then the actual, like, heat coming off of those has to be crazy to, like, feel in person. Dude, he just looks like a gangster, bro. <laughs> he looks like he's at war, bro. Like, this is like, I'm just, uh, I just don't even know how to interpret this. Like, it could go either way because he could be like a gay mechanic right there. <laughs> Let's be real. Hey, uh, the Don likes to see things <laughs> from other dimensions. He sees things through a prism. I mean, it looks like he's kind of got some oil on him. Like, you know. Yeah, you definitely like to see things through the prism. Rainbow. I mean, uh, yeah, you do. I don't mm -hmm. know what's going on. With I'm you. just saying, ain't nothing wrong. Yeah, I don't see nothing wrong with a little, little oil change. Damn, bro. Do host. Let's I'm see like, what other type of videos they have up. Bro, I just don't even. I'm just on some other right now. I'm just like, all right, I retire. All right, boys. You're showing 7 million subs. Okay. Let me hit this with a like because that was crazy. Hopefully there's nothing satanic in there. <laughs> I don't like to support Satanism, but that was kind of crazy. I've never seen one of their music videos. Imagine their music videos, bro. I do. I do. Let's For see. all their French homies. Do 500 host. million views. Half a billion wow. views. And it's like, what is this? Like, I just don't understand. Like, I know nothing about them. And it's like, look, we got a little, you know what I'm saying? A little mixy mix. Cool. Deutschland. 308 million views. Wow. Uh, again, like, I'm a fool. So I'm just thinking, like, they're a one-hit wonder because that's the one song I know of them. Look at this. And me sitting here in my ignorance. And they just have a catalog of bangers. So we're going to have to go through. Look at this dude. He look wild, bro. That's hilarious. That's tight. <laughs> <laughs> they got a sense of humor. All right, now, now Rammstein. Yo, if you like this reaction, put in the chat what the next Rammstein, 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 Ram, I don't know. Put in the chat which song we should react to next. Dude, these dudes are wild. They got so many videos, bro. With so many views. So crazy. Crazy. Anyways, you guys, I don't even know what to think. Like, literally, you've you're have you just watching someone get their mind blown on video. Because I'm like, I ain't never seen anything like that. And again, I haven't been to no super crazy concerts. Like, you know, not, uh, I'm kind of a cheapskate to keep it real. <laughs> <laughs> so, but dang, bro, that looked like an experience. That dude said, do. Uh, I don't know how they bro, say it. We're going to have to do like, a live reaction at like a Ramstein concert. Dude, I'm like tripping out, bro. <laughs> well, let's I, get I'm, backstage passes. We do a lot of reactions. So to get me like quiet, this quiet and just be like mind boggled. Like I just never seen like these dudes got the illest pyrotechnics. Their insurance has to be out of control. <laughs> I know. Yo, but I mean, with all those people, you're a balling, balling.
How much do you think they get paid a show? Like well, a million? I mean, that, that's what's wild to me is just like I, I've never seen any pyrotechnics like that. You know, so my mind immediately went to like, how do you even do that? Like he shot it, but then it's, you know, there it was another like heat seeking <clears throat> missiles and yeah. it went to where it's supposed to go. But then there, there was some other, I think the way that they actually pulled it off was there's another set of pyrotechnics that shot back yeah. at the, you know, stage. But that's where my mind goes is I start thinking about like, oh my God, think about the work that has to go into that. And then like you said, like it has to be done in a certain way. Cause you literally have a crowd of people where if something goes wrong, you're literally flame throwing your fans. Dude. Like it's all about roasting your fans. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> all right, you guys, yo, holy smoke. Um, literally you guys don't forget to like, share and comment on all the content. If you rocking with our vibe, <laughs> subscribe yeah that was wild y'all and i am a hater bro i was like oh what in wonders i got new house then is what it is hey you hate it yo shout out to rammstein that was ill if we're saying it right if we're saying it wrong go ahead and roast us 40 steinstein thank you for being I'm saying with the m i think it might be said different like ramen and stein or something i don't know roll back again